uh, what government failed that since when i give loan to some individual or rather when uh, companies are giving loan to uh, sorry banks are giving loan to some individual person there are very high instances that his or her businesses usually fail and he or she does not return that loan so even after the interest subvention even after the subsidy the businesses were failing and in bangladesh gramin bank did this experiment mohammad yunis was his name where they found that rather than if rather than giving the loan to an individual who is going to later turn into a vijay malya if we give the loan to some group of poor people these poor people usually return the loan so the idea came that why not give the loan to a group of individual for doing some activity rather than giving the loan to an individual person and that group of individual is known as self help group okay so it's an informal group of 10 to 20 people having similar socio economic background this is very important thing first is it's an informal group what is meant by informal group so like companies are registered under companies act so when you are registered as a legal entity this is called formalization okay so when you are not registered as a legal entity any kind of legal entity then it is called informal for example uh, four of you might sit together so it becomes a group but there is no legal name to it it is not a legal entity you do not register your group as a company or as a cooperative so this is called informal group and minimum number is 10 maximum number is 20 in a self help group okay and all these 10 to 20 people they should have a similar socio economic background their background should be similar so if one person is earning 10000 rupees another would also be earning in the range of 10000 only or all the 10 would be earning in this range only it would it would not be that one person is earning 1 lakh rupees per month and another is earning 10000 rupees per month this is not a similar group so if it is a group of poor people all 10 would be probably poor people only then they should be living in a small contiguous area contiguous means uh, living in their neighborhood so all the 10 and 20 people probably if these 10 people belong to some uh, say slum so all 10 should be living in that particular slum area only probably all 10 in the same villages all 10 in the same colony and so on who operate on the principle of self help this i will explain solidarity and mutual interest so this is why the name is self help group because they work on the principle of self help and solidarity what is this principle of self help self help means how it happens like uh, uh, you might also have seen in your neighborhood often it is name as jivika didi anyone have have you come across this name jivika didi no so what happens that these 10 people will form a group what will they do so see these are the usually this is the concept which is for the poor people so what these 10 people probably everyone lacks capital to start any of this business maybe that they are the poor artisan uh, they know the act uh, they know this skill of uh, uh making the various kind of clothes or making various kind of uh, uh, woolen wear but probably they do not have the capital individually to uh, start a entrepreneurship or any enterprise of their own but if all the 10 people come together probably they can collectively generate enough capital or if not in one day they can generate enough capital in if they do this saving on a daily basis so if this all these 10 people decide that every day we will we will make a saving kitty on every day everyone is going to deposit say 20 rupees okay so 20 into 10 is daily contribution in that kitty 200 rupees in 30 days this is going to be 6000 rupees so every month the kitty of 6000 is going to be generated this is not something which is illusionary or bahut hi imaginary idea to nahi hai every day these poor people can come up with 20 rupees saving now in 6 months time they will have 36000 rupees in this kitty now what they can do out of these 36000 rupees they can start one enterprise they can start a small shop 
दे कैन एटलीस्ट बाय ए ठेला दे कैन एटलीस्ट बाय द रॉ मटेरियल दैट दे आर सपोज टू यूज इन द मेकिंग ऑफ देयर वट एवर थिंग वट एवर आइडिया दे हैव ओके सो दिस इज हाउ दे आर सेल्फ डूइंग द सेल्फ हेल्प ऑफ दियर ग्रो इंडिविजुअली दे कुड हैव नेवर सेव्ड थर्टी सिक्स थाउजेंड रुपीज बट द ग्रुप कैन कलेक्टिवली डू दिस मच ऑफ सेविंग एंड दे कैन हेल्प ईच अदर एंड ऑल्सो वी हैव सीन दैट वन ऑफ द बिगेस्ट कॉज ऑफ पॉवर्टी वाज लाइक हेल्थ वेन एवर देर इज एन हेल्थ इमरजेंसी और देर इज सम uh kind of emergency catastrophic situation some death in the family usually they go to the poverty in that scenario also they can immediately take help from the group the group has a saving of say 36000 they can take a loan from there and we have seen that when they take loan from money lender in their villages the usual interest rate is very high 36% to 50% but when they are taking loan from their own group from their own saving probably they will take uh, loan at the very low interest rate of say 4% 6% 10% in this range only so they can access easy credit whenever in need because of this collectivization so this is how they are doing self help this is how they are engage in solidarity and mutual interest so they are doing two things first they are doing the saving then they are doing the lending among themselves whenever any member of that group is in need the group lends to that member and then that member repays it in equal installment like emi he repays it in 10 or 20 months or so on as the group decides so this way they are saved from the money lenders as well and this way they are saved from going into poverty and then they can collectively start their own enterprise as well okay so three way they are helping first they are doing saving then they are doing lending and then they can also start their own business so this idea was very successful in bangladesh then in in india also there was this ngo name mirada this ngo for the first time did the experiment with self help group you will study in more detail about self help group in your governance but we are touching few aspect of self help group here this ngo did the experiment with self help group for the first time in india and it was found that this self help group concept is very effective in poverty alleviation so rather than government also decided so rather than giving loan to individuals why not give loan to these self help groups then uh, nawad came to their rescue and nawad said that if whatever saving these people are doing they are keeping with one of the members i like in this 10 group uh, 10 people one of them will become treasurer and he will keep a kitty in which everyone is going to deposit this 20 rupees everywhere so what they will do is uh, if they keep this money with bank probably they can earn some interest as well so nawad nawad and rbi collectively they came up with this sg bank linkage program nawad said that we can open the bank i mean these sgs can open their bank account as well and they can keep their saving in bank account so nawad came up with this scheme sg bank linkage program where sg can open their bank account uh, and they can get interest so it will also provide some element of safety to their fund and they will also get interest payment so then nawad said that bank can give loan to these sgs if they are showing saving okay so after this bank linkage program the lending is also started so lending to sgs by bank started so now banks can give loan to these sgs in case of sgs their saving acts as the credibility that these are the people who can be trusted and they are going to return the loan no collateral is required so these loan the lending to sgs these are collateral free loan banks do not ask for any security if a sg is satisfactorily doing the saving in this bank account the only criteria is whether they are regularly saving this much amount whatever amount they have agreed and the amount of loan that they will take get from bank is linked to the amount of saving they are doing so usually the loan amount is four times the saving so now the capital that it has to start a venture or a start a business is 
इंक्रीज फोर टाइम्स बिकॉज ऑफ द लोन दैट दे आर गेटिंग विद द गवर्नमेंट इन एन आर आई एम स्कीम द गवर्नमेंट फर्दर सेट दैट वी विल डू इंटरेस्ट सेवेंसन If SSG does timely repayment of the loan, he would have to pay only four percent interest rate. <laughs> so, in a scheme, the government said that the interest which these SSG have to pay is going to be reduced because they are acting in a what you say self-help manner, solidarity and mutual interest.